Welcome back. Our extensive coverage of the coronavirus pandemic continues now. And each day, twice a day, the Florida Health Department updates its website on the number of coronavirus cases in the state. There is a wealth of information on that site, which goes well beyond the numbers on the screen. CBS 4 Steve Goldstein is live for us in the newsroom, and he continues our team coverage. Steve? Elliot, thanks very much. You could spend a long time on this web website, I could tell you that. And recently, there's been more specific things added to the website, so you can do a little bit of a deeper dive. We go inside the numbers on COVID-19 cases in the state. Some of the tools we have, first we look at new cases by the day, and we go back a couple of weeks where we got to about 1,000 cases, and we've been steady there for about two weeks. We see here one day we had a peak at 1,300 cases. We had a low right around 800 just a couple of times. So overall, the last two weeks in the state of Florida, we have averaged about 1,000 cases a day. Now, another one of the tools here on the website we have the tabs here and we can go to cases by zip code. So we zoom in on that and we look at the state of Florida. Obviously, South Florida, you see a lot of dark blue there. So we are the hot spot in the state, which makes sense because we have more population, more citizens in the rest of the state. But here we can zoom in on zip codes. So we'll slide it over to South Florida. We see the dark blue, but as you can see now, the red and the red is concentrated on zip codes with the highest number of cases in the state. So here's a zip code in Fort Lauderdale, and there we have 33311 with more than 200 cases. In Pembroke Pines, we've got a hotspot zip code, 33028, 438 cases. Now keep in mind, some of these zip codes may have healthcare facilities in them, so that makes a difference. Over here in Dade County, one spot there in the Hialeah area, another, further south. So let's go to Miami Beach and this zip code right here, a relatively small area. And we look at it in 33140, a large number, 322 cases. So you see just how specific you can get. There are more than 21,000 cases right now in Florida. More than half of them are in Miami-Dade and Broward. Now you can access the website yourself through our website, cbsmiami.com slash coronavirus. In the newsroom, Steve Goldstein, CBS 4 News.